Hey guys, I have a hat that you can crochet in two hours or less. Check it out. It's a super basic half double crochet beanie. Literally took me a little over an hour. I'm a fast crocheter. This is perfect for Christmas. Christmas is in less than two weeks. So join me in crocheting this beanie right now. If you're a huge fan of crochet tutorials and quick Christmas gifts, please click that like button. All right, let's go. The yarn I'm using for this project is a five weight yarn and the hook I am using is a six millimeter. We are starting off with a magic circle and I am half double crocheting eight half double crochets into the magic circle. Now, if you don't know how to do a magic circle, you can make the circle any way that you would like. Um, another way to do it is to chain three, slip stitch that together, and then crochet the eight half double crochets into the loop that those three chained together make. Okay, slip stitch. chain one. Oh, pull that tight. Chain one. Now two half double crochets into every half double crochet around. So you'll be half double crocheting into all eight half double crochets from the first round. So at the end of the round, you will have a total of 16 half double crochets at the end of round two. Okay, when you get to the end of the round, oh, not there yet. Okay, now you're going to, at the end of the round, after you've crocheted 16 half double crochets, slip stitch into the top of that first half double crochet from, the, from that round. So there you go, slip stitch, chain one. Now to the first half double crochet, you're going to one half double crochet. And you're going to be increasing by eight on the following six rounds. So one half double crochet, and then in the next stitch, two half double crochets. One half double crochet, in the next stitch, two half double crochets. All the way around, you repeat that one half double crochet, and then two half double crochets in the next stitch. If you're wondering what kind of yarn I'm using, it's Plymouth Encore Chunky. It's by Plymouth Yarns. And it's a very, very nice yarn. The hook I'm using is, like I said before, a six millimeter by Wee Crochet, and it is the Dots Crochet Hook. One of my personal favorites. Okay, at the end of the round, you will have 24 half double crochets. And just like before, slip stitch to the first half double crochet from that round. Chain one, now start on round 
four. Okay, half double crochet in the next two stitches and then two double crochets in the next stitch. And that's your repeat. Half double crochet, half double crochet, and then two half double crochets. Half double crochet, half double crochet, and then two half double crochets. So as you can see, it's a basic half double crochet pattern. This of course is the crown of the hat. And we are on round four right now. And there will be eight rounds total in the crown of the hat. Okay, we're coming to the end of round four. Now we're going to slip stitch to the beginning of the round, close that off, chain one. Now we're going to half double crochet into the next four stitches. And then in that next one, two half double crochets. So that's the repeat. Four half double crochets, and then two half double crochets in the next one. So continue this six stitch repeat all the way around to the end of the round. And when you get to the end of the round, you will have a total of 48 half double crochets. We're at the end of round five, and I saw that my middle was coming a little bit unloosened or untightened, whatever. So I tightened it a little more. I just pulled that center pull tight. Don't worry about that thread or it being too loose. We'll weave that in at the end, and that'll take care of that circle coming undone. Okay, let's get started on round six. We're going to slip stitch, chain one, half double crochet into the next five stitches. And then in that sixth stitch, we're going to put two half double crochets and that is our repeat for this round. Five half double crochets, then two half double crochets. So it is a seven stitch repeat. You'll crochet that a total of eight times and at the end of this round, you will have a total of 56 half double crochets. Alrighty, keep crocheting and I will meet you at the end of this round. Okay, we are starting on round eight, which is the final round of the crown of the hat. And we'll half double crochet into the first six stitches and then half double crochet two into the seventh stitch. So it is an eight stitch repeat. That is six half double crochets and then a 
two half double crochet and you will repeat that all the way around for a total of eight repeats and at the end of the round you will have 64 half double crochets Alrighty, I will see you at the end of the round. Okay, now at this point we've completed the crown of the hat. We have eight rounds. We started in the center with eight stitches and each round we increased by eight stitches. And see how it is a little bit concave? You want it to be that way. It just has a slight rounding to the top there. That's right where your head goes. And now we're gonna start crocheting the sides. Okay, this is round nine. For the next eight rounds, you will be half double crocheting in every stitch around for a total of 64 stitches in each round. You'll slip stitch to the beginning, chain one, start on the next round, it's easy peasy and I will see you at the end of round 16. Okay, that went super fast. We've got the crown, we've got the main part of the hat. Now we're going to start in on the brim. And in the brim, it's very easy, single crochet into every stitch around. I chained one at the beginning and now we're going to single crochet in every stitch around for a total of 64 single crochets. I will meet you at the end of this round. Okay, now we're going to be starting the ribbing here on round 18. Slip stitch to that first single crochet of the round, chain one, and then single crochet into that same stitch that you slip stitched into. And now double crochet into the next stitch. And then single crochet and double crochet. And you're going to repeat the single crochet double crochet all the way around. Okay, I will meet you at the end of the round. When you get to the end of the round, you will have crocheted a total of 32 single crochets and 32 double crochets. Now you'll be ending the round on a double crochet and you'll join with a slip stitch to the first single crochet. Now chain one and single crochet into that single crochet. The next stitch you will front post double crochet. Stick your hook right back behind that double crochet from the previous round and double crochet through that. Okay, single crochet front post double crochet yarn over insert your hook back behind that front post of the double crochet and then double crochet single crochet front post double crochet single crochet, front post double crochet, and you will continue this all the way around. And at the end of the round, you will have 32 single crochets and 32 front post double crochets. And the front post double crochets, this repeat is what is making the ribbing on the brim of the hat. So repeat these two stitches all the way around and I will see you at the end of the round. 
Okay, we are starting in on round 20. And it is a repeat of row 19. Single crochet into the single crochet of the previous round and front post double crochet around the front post double crochet of the last round. And you'll see the ribs of the ribbing starting to form here. Oops. Front post double crochet, single crochet, front post double crochet, single crochet, front post double crochet, and continue to do this all the way around the hat until you reach the end of this round. Round 21 is exactly the same as round 20. Just single crochet, front post double crochet all the way around. And um, I will meet you once again at the end of the round. Now the ribbing can be as long or as short as you want it to be. For the length I am making this hat, I'm going to finish this round and crochet one more round of the ribbing before adding the final round. Round 22 is going to be the final round of the ribbing. So here we go, we chained one, single crochet, front post double crochet, single crochet, front post double crochet, and then repeat that all the way around to the end of the round. And I will see you there. Okay, we are going into round 23, which is the final round of the hat. And to end off the hat, we're going to make it easy and just single crochet all the way around single crochet into every stitch and I will see you at the end of the round. So when we get to the end we're just going to tie off one of my favorite parts of the project. I'm gonna pull it through. I'm not gonna actually tie a knot because I want to make it a little seamless. I'm going to cut it and then pull it through to the back and then weave in the ends. And weaving in is not fun for me, but it is a necessary evil. It must be done. So let's weave in those ends and I'm doing it real fast. I wish it went this fast in real life, but it doesn't. But let's weave those ends in. <laughs> I'm doing this so I can show you that it can be done. You just need a tapestry needle and you just work that yarn in and then you snip it. I'm going to take that center pull right there and weave it in and pull it tight. Pull that little O tight so that it doesn't come undone Then cut it off. All right, how do you like that? Are you wearing your hat now? I hope so, I hope you love the pattern. If you do, please subscribe to the channel so you don't miss a tutorial or second of Yarny Fun. Merry Christmas.